Hey friend, my name's T. Welcome back to The Journey. So glad you're here. You know, I wanna tell you about, about something. I've been working on this project now for about three or four months. Just, I poured so much into this thing and I'm just so excited that I get, I get to tell you a little bit about it today. I wrote a 25 page guide on how to quit alcohol, right? How to quit alcohol. And if you've clicked on this video, uh, you might have some kind of sense of like, you know, maybe alcohol is not, 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 not the best thing for you right now. Or maybe you're just drinking more than you, than, than you would like. And you know what the fucked up thing about all of that is? Is that as soon as those questions start going through your mind, you have this other side where you realize that your friends and society and people, you like, you can't talk about it. Society is all about a binary relationship with alcohol, meaning that you have the people that can hand, quote unquote handle it right the drinkers the normies and you've got all the rest of the people that are like well they have a problem so so i have a problem now because i'm questioning sh should i drink as much as i'm drinking why am i drinking as much as i'm drinking i don't want to drink this much but yet i wind up drinking more than i want to what's going on with all of that right you would think that that common problem with all these people drinking and that so many people and i'm telling you i talk to people a lot this is a very common situation that you would think that more people would be okay talking about this, but they're still not. There's not enough people talking about it. And that's why I'm putting my voice out there. Society is like, oh, if you even mention, even mention that you might have a problem with alcohol, not a problem, fuck that. If you just mention that you're like, you know what, I'm not really happy drinking as much as I do. I wanna do something about it. People are like, what, what's your, what's your are you are you saying you wanna use the A word? Are you an alcoholic? Don't even fucking pick up that word. That's not your word. My point is, is that society wants you to pick up that word, you take a label, you gotta go sit in meetings, and you gotta do it for the rest of your life. And I reject all of that. That is not the path, right? The path forward, and science has proven this out. Now, now I'm just gonna tell you, addiction is extremely complicated. There is no consensus or resolution it is mental it's physical it's emotional it's all wrapped up in our brain okay and 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 it requires some work and 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 right now right now where I'm at with this is like you're, you're potentially you're on it you realize if you're thinking about this you're on you, you realize okay I'm on an elevator and it's going down and it's easy I'm just sitting here having a good time you know don't have to do much work and I'm just going down 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 and you're thinking about it you're like ah, maybe it's not it's not maybe you've had a few close calls with some things relationships friends whatever and it's like why are you gonna wait for a rock bottom why are you gonna wait for that step off this elevator that's my message you step off now but my message in truth to you is that there is no elevator going up it's a staircase and you're going to have to put one foot on that staircase and climb that stairs with you uh climb that climb your way out of this and that's why i wrote the guide i put everything I, I i really thought about like what did i do it took me two years and i did it on my own i was a little bit stubborn i went back and read all my journals and all the things and the books that i looked at and and i and i wrote out my process and i and, and based upon the feedback that i've gotten from from uh, from a sampling of people that I've shared it with, a lot of a lot more positivity. It's it's still rough around some edges from from gr grammar or maybe a typo or two. I still find one or two every time I look at it, and it bugs me. But I've got to get it out there in the world. So I want I want you to have it. I want you to have it, and I want you to read it. And and I just want to ask if you read it. I have a special email at the end. Just shoot me an email and let me know what you thought of it. Not all the mistakes, but like how you felt about it. I'd love to hear about it. So going back to that staircase, right? Uh, society wants to give you all this shame and blame and you have the problem and all the rest. And what I'm saying is, and what, what the science is really saying is that you approach this alcohol thing with a sense of mindfulness is what they use or what they say. Mindfulness, meaning that, um, you're curious, you learn, you, you reflect, you sit. Like I'm sitting here amongst these trees. You can't see the trees above me. Uh, maybe I'll put a picture of this little squirrel that came and visited me a minute ago. And I'm just, I'm just enjoying being alive. That's one of the things that I love so much about my sober life that I live. Uh, 
is that I'm present, and that's such a cliche word, but I am so present with the moment all the time. Like, I'm just happy to be here. I'm not wanting something. I'm not, I'm not thinking about getting something to drink or even food or anything. I'm just sitting here thinking with my gray hair that I now have, like, I'm just happy to be here. And, and there's some of you out there, you know, that, that are around my age, I'm 54, that if you're in your 50s, it's like, are you really ready to just wind it down? Like, this is it? Play around a golf, go sit at the bar, you know? It's like, it's like, let's wind this shit up, you know? And it's not just about getting sober so you can be more productive or, or uh, you know, some kind of hack. It, it's just about like, man, it's like feeling every day on this planet and just being like i have consciousness i'm a i'm aware that i that that i i'm aware that i'm aware it's 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 crazy it's just crazy and so i want to help you get to this place right when you peel back that layer of alcohol there's going to be some shit down in there but do you want to deal with the shit and all the shit with booze or do you want to just deal with what's down there and have a clear mind and be present with people and with this reality, uh, I think I'm, I'm here to tell you it's so much better on the other side. I'm over here. It can be done. You can do this. Okay. So I want you to, to, you have to put your email address in. It's just the way the modern wor- world is. And when you hit confirm and you confirm your, your subscription, that PDF is going to pop up and it's yours. Just download it, read it. Let me know what you think. That's the deal. Okay. Um, I'm here for you. You're not alone in this process, and and I, I want I want to I want to help you. So uh, thank you so much for watching this video, and I look forward to seeing your name in my inbox. Thank you, my friend.